Germany doesn't want to bail out Greece and Italy, its own neighbors and its own partners in the Eurozone, right? So we are now, as the United States, going to make a huge contribution to printing this money to get this done. And as Stuart says, the stock market likes it. But in the overall long-term economic outlook, take a look at what this means. I know there's a lot of numbers on this screen, okay? But this is very significant because it shows just how much trouble these countries are in. When you look at the debt to GDP ratio, right, this is how much debt they have compared with their gross domestic product, how much they're, they're putting out. Look at Greece, okay? Everybody knows what Greece's economic troubles have been. 165% of, of debt to their GDP, which is 312. Okay, Italy's at 121% of their total output, they owe more than that in debt. Ireland is at 109%. You've heard about how tough Ireland's situation is. Portugal at 106. But here's the really scary thing, folks. We're at 100. We're at 100% debt to GDP ratio. And a healthy environment for the U.S. economy would be maybe 60, 65%, 70% of that GDP to debt ratio. So this is a very disturbing, huge set of numbers here now.